fresh off the ill Hawaiian recharge. I'm back. I'm back in effect. Um, I just went out for my me and my wife's anniversary out to Honolulu. Super dope. It's my first time in Hawaii. Had a great time. It was, it was, it was a lot of fun. Went to go up in the chopper. Doors off. off doors off fucking doors off hey um we went to pearl harbor too which was kind of like a surprise to me i didn't really expect to i didn't know if we were going to go there it wasn't on our like itinerary and then once we got there i was so glad that we went beautiful place um on top of the fact that it's got such a historic tragic past that just being there is just a weird vibe like the energy is crazy there so i was glad we got to do that um the whole trip in general was good and i and i it was, it was really for me and my wife's anniversary, but it was also great timing for me to be out of town, to just break away from release week jitters uh, for a little bit. You know, my release week ended on Friday. We got there like Thursday. And then basically through the weekend, wouldn't figure out until uh, Monday, uh, the reports and stuff. So we did good. If you supported the album, thank you for supporting the album. It is out now. If you haven't gotten it yet, pause this video. Stop watching this right now. Go stream it. Download it, go to Best Buy, buy a copy, grab it off any, it's everywhere. Last one, we found it. Boom. Thank you. Found it. High fives, we did it. We did it. <laughs> it's everywhere you can buy music, I want to say. And if it isn't, ask them to stock it. Let them know you need that album in there. Uh, we did 3,300 uh, sound scans, which is uh, <clears throat> pre-orders, any digital purchases, streams combined. For, you know once they reach the album limit which is I think 1500 streams I'm pretty sure then it becomes one scan so we did 3300 I don't know if the 3300 is including the streams or not now so it might be a little bit more but uh, not bad not bad I said uh, my goal that I set for myself was 4000 I wanted to hit 4k if I could hit 4k then I was like okay I'm happy because I believe War Within did 4500 4700 in its first week and that was four years ago and the whole market has changed a lot in four years majority of people that were buying those CDs or buying digital downloads then are not d buying music anymore they're streaming it and it takes way more streams to get a sale so I was I was not expecting to get the 4500 or 4700 I did four years ago but I wanted to get close and I was about 700 off of hitting 4000 so I'll take that as a I'll take that as a win you know I always want to get bigger and better better numbers and we did do that on the pre-order so thank you for pre-ordering the album if you did uh but yeah it was just shy of my mark on um on sound scans for the first week but it's the first week and we are an independent label and we are an independent group um so with the, the backing behind us is a, it's a small humble movement you know what i mean so i'm i'm cool with the numbers there i know they're not gonna be you know crazy through the roof it's a slow burn as is all my projects to, to date you know um so thank you for supporting the album i barely had time to soak in the release week and i'm still kind of you know i'm still promoting the album obviously it's gonna be like i said a slow burn but amongst all of that it's already mayday time i'm, I'm already into mayday land uh we had already started production on mayday's next album called search party uh before into the further was even out and um, we've been working on it slowly and now we're ramping up the production now that I'm finished with Into the Further and our deadline is coming around the corner. So it's set for an August release. We're in the studio. We've had um, Stro stop by at the studio. Yeah, if you want. I mean, I just feel like you could, yeah, whatever, do whatever you want. I just feel like you get an angrier sound out of there. But, uh, yeah. Punchier. You said angry? <laughs>
this week with George Spitz uh, from Llama Beats, who did uh, four tracks on Into the Further, him and his, him and his crew. We got George Spitz in the studio. Miyagi in the studio. Crack bone, crack bone. Crack bone, crack bone. Uh, so he came by to Miami to work with us a little bit. Um, we're bringing people in and out of the studio. We're basically just trying to do as much work as possible for the next two or three weeks solid and and knock this Mayday album out. And so far, so good. It's, it's coming out. To me right now, it's coming out as a mixture between Stuck on an Island and, and Take Me to Your Leader. It's just kind of like... And future vintage, I guess, if you want to throw that in there as well. It's just like a good marrying of like our original sound when we first came out and our like post strange music sound. So I think um, I, I'm, I'm excited about it and um, we're working hard as hell on getting this album to be the best it can be. So I just wanted to check in with y'all real quick. I didn't really get to do much vlogging or anything while I was on vacation, which I guess is kind of the point of vacation. And um, now I'm just into the thick of it. Uh, with with Mayday. So all I want to say is stay tuned for the Mayday album. Follow at Mayday Music on all the socials um, and uh, stay tuned with the album updates. Pre-order probably coming in the you know, not too distant future. And if you haven't already supported it or heard the album Into the Further, please go out. I'll put the link right now in the description. You can click that link. It'll give you a list of all the places you can get the album pretty much like all the digital retailers will be there um if you want to buy a hard copy like they have all those links there in this page so um you can hit my website and which the link is below and um and you can you can find it wherever you want to find it so uh appreciate you thank you for supporting the album i'm getting great feedback more importantly than any numbers or any amount of sound scans or units or streams the feedback has been good for everyone that's heard it i've seen very little negative reviews so that's great at least the first initial reactions have been so positive so thank you for that uh so i love y'all thank you very much appreciate you see you soon peace